You can stare at an empty pond or you can go find new ponds full of fish. <laughs> staring at an empty pond and go find a pond full of fish. Hello y'all, I'm Diana Brienne. Well, I'm a sweaty mess right now. I just finished my five mile run. I have a lot of sunblock on. If so, if I look sunblocky, that's what it is. <laughs> it was very, very hot out there today. And um, you can see it's kind of an overcast day out here on grandma's porch, but it's a wonderful, beautiful day out here. And so I just finished the five mile run and now I'm getting ready for all my college work which y'all know at 63 years old I'm a full-time college student and uh, so I have a lot of work a lot of work and uh, so I got to get started but I wanted to make a video first and I got to thinking about people who want to focus on the negative you know we can focus on the negative or we can focus on what we can do in life where we give our focus is where we're going to get our results in most situations and so I believe in giving my focus on what I can achieve Chief. And often people will stand at an empty pond and say, there's no fish, there's no fish. But they stand there anyhow and throw the fishing pole in and try to catch a fish, okay? Their time would be better spent seeking out ponds that have a lot of fish. And they're out there. You just have to seek them out. So are you one of those people that look at an empty pond or are you one of those people that are out there looking for a pond full of fish? I'm always looking for a pond full of fish. I don't stick very long at an empty pond unless maybe I want to go swimming. <laughs> And I don't think I'd go swimming in a pond anyhow. Maybe a swimming hole, but not a pond. We grew up with swimming holes where I was from. We didn't have like the local pool so much. So we went to the swimming hole and it was wonderful. Fresh water and everything like that. So, but yes, you know, what we give our focus to tends to flourish and what we do not give focus to tends to diminish. And so I believe the things that I want in life, I'm going to give my focus to. And so that I will see those things grow. And part of that focus is going to the right places in life where our opportunities are, whether it's a pond full of fish or no fish, whether it's a place where there's going to be a lot of job opportunity or relationship opportunity or skiing opportunity. If you like to ski, if you live in Florida, likely you're not going to be able to mountain, you know, snow ski. You might be able to water ski, but not snow ski. But if you go to the mountains and live and you want to water ski, you may have to move to Florida. <laughs> so what I'm basically saying is sometimes we have to go where our opportunities are rather than just stand there and stare at an empty pond or what we don't have. Begin to look at ways that we can find what it is that we want to achieve or what we want to have. From my house to yours, may God bless you. And I hope to talk to you soon again. Bye-bye. to relax and a place to enjoy.